What's up guys, it's that time of the year once again and today is upgrade day. It's time to upgrade my iPhone 15 Pro Max to the new iPhone 16 Pro Max and we are back in the tech wonderland, also known as Shenzhen. I just arrived in the city and we are going to explore the local markets. The new iPhones have been out of stock for a couple of weeks after their release here in China, both at the wholesale markets and at the Apple stores. This happens every year after the release and this year is no exception. The wholesale markets are currently selling iPhones for just a few hundred yuan less than the official price. As always, the price will decrease about 2 months after the release. However, if you want to get the phone early, you have to pay top dollar. I got the iPhone 16 Pro Max for 200 yuan less than the official price, which was 9,990 yuan. However, I am going to sell my old iPhone and make another video to show you how much I sold it for. Here in Shenzhen you can get a pretty sweet price for your old iPhone depending on its condition. Now we are heading to the nearest Starbucks to do a quick unboxing of the new phone and I will be transferring my data from my old iPhone. This is Huachan Bay guys, all the amazing deals happen here. And here it is, the new iPhone 16 Pro Max in Desert Titanium. I was considering getting the white one this time, but since this is a new color, I decided to check it out. And honestly, I have to say it looks way better in person than in the photos. As you probably already know, there isn't a huge difference compared to the previous model. We've got a faster processor, but aside from that, the changes are pretty minor. There is also a new button, which to be honest feels almost useless right now. I'm really hoping they add more functions to it, because otherwise I don't see myself using it much. The camera has seen some minor improvements, which I'll be testing out in my future videos. And we also have a slightly larger display. But the big talk is about AI, which is supposed to be the standout feature, unfortunately is not yet available. And I suspect that here in China the functionality might be pretty limited. But we have to wait to see what the Apple will bring. I also be making the usual accessory videos at the local market, so make sure to subscribe to catch that one when it drops. I've already done a quick look around and there are some super cool phone cases and accessories for the new iPhone 16 lineup. As I mentioned, I'll be selling my iPhone 15 Pro Max soon after I transfer all my stuff to the new phone, which I'm starting right away. So stay tuned for that video too, I'll show you how much you can really get for it here in Shenzhen. Until then, thanks for watching and as always, don't forget to subscribe, like and comment. Don't be shy, stay cool and I will see you in the next one.